Welcome everybody to DePaws. We have a great game between Wyoming and the DePaul Blue Demons. DePaul is coming to this game at number 10 team in the country. And of course, they are led by their head coach in his very first season, George Mikan. He is 4-0 in his first four games of the season. Now have a tough one today. Of course, the Star Watch player for the ball to look out for, of course, is Kobe Cowan. He's a shooting guard, the senior. He leads the team in points and expect him to get a lot of points today. And of course, for Wyoming, it is Parker Cowens. No relation to these two, but he is a shooting guard, a junior, listing at 6'2. Expect him to get a lot of points as well. We'll see who will win this game between Wyoming and DePaul. Expect a great one here. Another home one for DePaul. And of course, here are the starting lineups for both sides as we will send a down corporate tip off between Wyoming and DePaul. As the tip up goes and we're underway as the ball gets the ball first to start the game. Here of course is Cowan. Little pick and roll action. He'll keep it for a second passes over to Curtis, the point guard, who's been on fire with dishing out dimes early on in the season. Cowan, the mid-range jump shot and misses. Rebound goes to Wyoming. Here they go on a quick break over the Cowan. The Star Watch player is fouled. Here is the pass over. Here is Blizzard for three is good from downtown. Here's a nice pass down to Hollins. The easy layup's good. Seven to one is the score. Nice pass to Granger for the easy layup. Makes it fall. Seven to three is the score. Here's Curtis. Curtis down the Granger for the shot is good. Here is Cowan, the player. And watch out for as he gets the layup. Nine to seven. And that's going to be stolen. Here they are in transition. Here is Hollis just flushing it down. 11 to 7 is the score. Thornton, nice little dribble moves, weaving his way in. 13 to 9. Curtis, nice pass down to Laws who flushes down with the two handed jam. And that's going to be stolen as Laws would get the foul and one opportunity for Laws. Here is the free throw attempt is good for the old fashioned three point play. Here's Blizzard. He'll try a three of his own again. Makes it fall from downtown. Here is Curtis. No one steps in front of Curtis as he'll march his way all the way to the bucket. Here is a three right there is good for Wyoming. It's a one point game. Here is Curtis. In transition. No one's stopping him again as he gets the easy layup. Here is a jump shot by Blizzard. 24-23, here is a shot by Granger, makes it fall and goes in. Here they go, Bowman, nice pass over to the shooting guard for the easy layup. So one point lead, that is a Blizzard 3 is good from downtown. Nice pass down to Laws who gets the easy little layup to fall. Here is Hollins, nice little play there by Hollis, he gets the layup. He has 6. Here is Thornton. Pass over to Laws who flushes it down with two hands. Here is a pass to Bowman. The shot rattles up and in. On the fast break, Hollis down to Bowman. He gets the layup to fall as they're up by four. With the final second to the first half, here is Curtis. He will miss it, grab his own board, but that will be the end of the first half as Wyoming takes a four point lead over DePaul as we have an upset watch happening as we'll like to see you guys at the start of the second half. I can't think of too much good to say about this game so far. Maybe you can do play by play and color. And now it's time to show you our player of the half. Bill Blizzard is my pick, Burn. He's finding ways to score every trip down the floor, and he's carrying his team. He's been a force on the offensive end and is putting on a show for everyone here. A phenomenal performance. Tremendous effort from our player of the half. Welcome to the start of the second half between Wyoming 
and DePaul. Wyoming leads number 10, DePaul, by four. Here is a quick three, and the corner is good for Blizzard. He has 14 points already, and Wyoming takes a seven-point lead. As, of course, Ebby's third assist to the game. Curtis, nice pass down low. The Granger easy shot's good. Here is a three right there is good by Cowens. Cowens passing the corner to Blizzard again from three. As the ball is down by 12. Here is a pass over the Cowens is good for three for the ball. Here is an easy shot there by Cowens for Wyoming. Curtis down to Laws. The hook shot's good. It's 11 point lead. Hollis. Kicks it. Here's a blizzard wide open. Three is good again. They're down by 14. Here's a Laws bucket. It's a 14 point lead. Bruff to mid range is good. Kicks it. The Menno spinning his way in the layup is good. It's an 18 point advantage as the Hollis jump shot's good. Here is Thornton. That shot's good. Cuts it down to 18. Here is Meadow, the shot is good again. For him, the little hot shot there is good. Here is Cowan. He will shoot a three with a guy in his face, nails in the three. They're down by 15 for him. Nice pass to Granger, misses, grabs his own board and puts it up and in. They're down by 13, that's a shot there is good. It's a 15 point lead, Curtis in the corner for three. Here is Thornton, crossing his way for the layup and is a 10 point lead. Here on the break, they're down by 10. Here is Curtis all the way, is it now single digits? Here's a pass that's stolen. Good defense by Laws. Here is Curtis on the fast break as he will get blocked, but he will grab his own board and puts it in. Here's pass down low. The Hollands is good. Curtis, pass the walls. He'll get a little jump shot, hook shot. It's a six point lead. That pass is stolen by Curtis as he gets the shot to go. It is now a four point lead. Another steal. This one by Thornton as he will be fouled on the play. As he will shoot the second free throw is good. It's now down by three. Here's Wyoming, another steal by Curtis as he will get fouled again. What a sequence here by DePaul. Here's the first free throw is good by Curtis. Here is Cowan, knife pass down the Hollis. He gets the layup. It's a four point lead under one minute remaining. Curtis goes all the way for the two handed slam. And that pass can be tipped off and that will be DePaul's ball. Great defense there by Walls. It's a two point lead. Curtis will go all the way as we're all tied here. Here we go, Hollis. He gets troubled, he will be a turnover as the ball will get it with 19 seconds remaining. Here we are, four seconds, pass down to Granger. Slams it home, three seconds remaining. No timeouts for Wyoming. They will have to kick it. They'll have to shoot a shot. That shot will not count as DePaul will finish a 22 point comeback. And DePaul will advance to 5 0 on the season. Of course, the player of the game is Curtis with 22 points and 10 assists as well. A great game by him. And DePaul with a fantastic comeback victory as well for them. Great game as we will like to send it to the guys in the studio for the post game show. Pontiac Game Changing Performance. Hi and welcome everyone to the 2K Sports Studios. I'm Greg Gumbel and we're going to bring you our Pontiac Game Changing Performance. This is an amazing shot that combines concentration with accuracy. The DePaul Blue Demon have their spirit lifted after this amazing four point play. To be able to knock down a three after getting fouled and then make the free throw is something else. Thank you, Greg. All right, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. What a comeback, man. Down by 22. I totally thought we were going to lose. You see, I'm helping save the game here real quick. So we uh, we get the progress saved. But a 22-point comeback. I did not think we were going to win down, what, I think 62 to 40 at the time. And 
everything just went our way. Curtis, as you've seen, 22 and 10, fantastic. Everything went our way from the, uh, the, the steals on the inbounds to knocking it off to do shin to uh, trapping the guy and him throwing it to the wrong dude and then going out of bounds. Fantastic. Of course, Zalz with 15, Granger with 14. Great games by them as well. So they shot good, of course. And what, what can I say, man? Calvin only had six, but that's all right. Looking ahead, Blizzard played a great game for them. He had 22. Uh, Cowans for them also had a good 15 and Hollis had 12, but we did a great game We did everything we needed to do to get a comeback. We made our shots. We played good defense We didn't turn the ball over and what else can I say but a great game from us? So without further ado guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video as we move to 5-0. Next game will be a very tough game as you will see on Thursday. But if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to let me know by dropping a like and leaving a comment and subscribing. And hit the bell next to it for post notifications. It does let you know every time I do upload a video. And in the links in the description, you can check out the playlist as well as all my social media pages. Without further ado guys, hope you guys have a great rest of your day. And I will catch you guys in the next video. Deuces!